Hello? Can you hear me? I'm back on my two computer setup and everything is broken, so... <laughs> It's fine. The bot's a little bit broken. I might be able to hang on if I if I get into the thing. If I get into this crate is blocking the door. See, that's working. That's all in OBS. Finding a dinosaur, I had to shoot it in space. Nice. Good job. Also, we haven't started yet. Um I get some swoosh. The chat just disappear. Everything's broken. <laughs> I don't know how anything worked. No chat's there. Okay, that's fine. Text to speech might work now, but it might not appear on screen. It might just be sound. I don't know. The whole thing's balk. Much of many balk is happening. But we'll deal with it. But yes, hi. Welcome to a game that is too powerful for my computer, so I have to have two computers to stream it. It sounds very, um, indulgent. But one of those computers is over ten years old. <laughs> is that my P-organ? I don't know! Um, it, it looks like an organ. It looks like a heart. I'm guessing it's a heart. Not, not a clue. Out and proud for all of us to see. I didn't put it there. If somebody puts my P organ out on display, that's not my fault. Um, how are we doing? Are we well? Yeah, we have like semi bot functionality. Anything that works in chat should work. We might get the audio for TTS. I don't know. Um, also, rumbles and rain. Oh, I would like rumbles and rain. Because at the moment, it's just very humid. I'd like for that to come to something, but here we are. Uh, and not in the way that our uh, locked friend mentioned earlier. <clears throat> but yes, plant should work. That's an HTML, that's fine. Um, most things should work. There's just a couple of things that the bot does that might be a bit dodgy. Much better than this morning. Hurrah! Good job. Um, yes, welcome to Liza P. It, 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 his sounds. Test. Okay, so you get the audio, but you don't get the on-screen thing. I can fix that. <laughs> it's something, all right? There'll also occasionally be crackly audio because the yeah, Elgato's weird. I'm trying, all right? <laughs> um, don't expose bums or pee organs. That is not how this works. But yes, this is Lies of P, um, as generously donated um, to me, donated, gifted, that's the word I'm looking for, um, gifted to me by Miss, very kind, because apparently there's a boss in here that they wanted me to see, and fight, and deal with. Lies of P, lies of P, lies of P! For anyone who doesn't know what this is, this is What If Bloodborne, but Pinocchio. That's pretty much the brief, I think, that's basically all I know. There's also some people with rabbit ears and a bucket on their head, I'm up for that. Um... I've also been told that this is basically the best the the best of these sorts of games that isn't made by From Software. So that's high high accolade, as far as I'm considered. The boss that made you go, Chris needs this game. <laughs> oh dear. <clears throat> well, we'll see, I suppose. I've needed this game for a while. I very much look forward to playing it, but I'm also a very patient person. Um but um Miss, however, is more generous than I am patient. So let's let's give it a crack. Just for the bloodborneness of it. Anything that's got bloodborneness would be nice. It says continue because I got in there to sort of test um, whether or not my computer could play it without exploding. I think it can. We'll find out. Um, but yes, we will start a new game. I, I deliberately did not watch. Oh, it's it, that's beating now. <clears throat> deliberately did not watch any cutscenes or anything, so I don't know what's coming. I did notice it does say in the corner now lying. And uh, if chat wasn't there, uh, you'd see that the loading bar is a nose. In honor of Carlo Colludi, who I assume wrote Pinocchio. I know nothing about Pinocchio. Can you hear me? Yes. It's a butterfly. Is that Jiminy Cricket? 
Geppetto's puppet. We need your help. Okie dokie. And we're off. Straight away. Blue Fairy? Is that a different thing? Is that not... Oh, it was actually gameplay. Oh, there we are. Okay, well, that was that was brief. Um, we're in. If it breaks, back to trains. I think we're on a train, which kind of helps. But it's us. Look at us. We're... Uh, Timothy Chalamet. The lad! We can spin real fast. <laughs> Let's go! Uh, yeah, let me know about volumes and all that. Um... Blue Fairy is a Pinocchio thing. Got it. Cool. You will have to help me with that, because I'm not uh, not versed in the Pinocchio lore. Should read the story, really. It's not, yeah. Appreciate some of the things. Sounds good. Sounds good. Sounds good. Don't need to watch June Part 2. Yeah. Ah, yeah. There you are. Hello? I've been looking all over for you. You the fairy? Yep, fairy? Okay. From what I tested as well, it seems to play almost exactly like Bloodborne or something like that, so that's handy. I'm sure there's going to be like one button combination I need to know that I'm, is going to trip me up, but we'll see. We'll see. We walk very slowly at the moment. This is fancy. Can interact with A. Interact with the bar? No. Presumably this. Jiminy already starts soon. What? I see they got Jiminy too. But we have to hurry. Oh, Gemini. Gemini. <laughs> My name is Sophia. Please come to Hotel Crot, and I'll explain what's happening. Hotel Crot. Jiminy, please escort him to the hotel. Jiminy? Oh, uh, ah, use belt. Select upper belt, select lower belt. Use the selected belt item. Okay, so that's item things. Equip items and gestures on the belt to use them. Blood. Blood. Uh, hold down to activate the extra bag. The extra bag. Now to use items, equip items and gestures in the extra bag. Okay, so wait. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. Got it. What is that? I don't know what that is. Monad's lamp. Light. The line up. Light. Sh light up. Light up. I see. Then up there, that's like heels, I guess. This is. Shiny bum. Got a shiny bum. Okie dokie. How is, how is menus? Equipment. Ah! I got a top hat and a dog. Okay. <laughs> oh, I got a Santa hat. <laughs> my butt lamp is next to my P organ. It's fine. Oh, B organ. Um, I'm, I'm assuming this is all, like, special event stuff. Azure Dragon Crescent Glaive. Great sword. Slash and stab. Much attacking. Charge pulse cell. Fable charge. I know what all these things mean. Uh, they seem, however, like bonuses. And uh, I'm not doing bonuses. Bonuses are fine. We're, we're all good. Defense parts. Workshop Union certified liner. Okay, cool. That's armor, I guess. Usable items. Upper belt. Pulse cell. Use pulse cell to recover HP. There's a maximum number of times pulse cells can be used. It's Esther, it's cool. Um, oh, if you attack enemies while the cell is discharged, the pulse cell will gradually be charged. Ah, sort of a Hollow Knight kind of thing. Neat. Pulse cells are ergo cells that power the P organ. We're there already. <laughs> they work with stargazers and they can also convert the energy from the attack's impact into recharge. Words. Grinder, we've got a grinder, everyone. Pulse cells are ergo cells that power the P-organ. They are words, certainly, yes. Uh, weapon durability decreases each time you attack enemies with a weapon. Use a grinder to repair your weapons. When durability falls to zero, attack decreases and the weapon cannot be repaired with a grinder. Okay, so make sure you keep the weapon durability in mind. Dark Souls 2 rules. Um, it's advised to keep an eye on durability gauge. To those in battle, the grinder is their lifeline. Sharpness of the blade can mean life or death. Monad's lamp. Um... A small lamp with a cricket guide puppet inside. It illuminates the darkness with a faint light. Do not be afraid, even if you get lost in the fog, the cricket guide will be with you. It's, it's Gemini. Last resort. Ah, dark sign. Special device that releases all of the P-organ's energy at once. 
We're not laughing at it. We're not. We're not. Um dies upon use. The old man feared the possibility of his son failing to awaken the, uh, properly and going into a frenzy. This initialization device was made as a necessary evil for delicate readjustments. A kill switch. We have a kill switch. Interesting. Uh, costume. So this is purely aesthetic. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, that's, that's neat. I like that. Can we rotate? Can we... No. no. Yeah. Oh, that looks cool. I like that. I love that. <laughs> what if we were just a dog? Have you considered the possibility of us just being a dog? Fancy, but now we're Wonka. Now we're Wonka. Look at that. Uh, let's. Uh, we're gonna go. We're gonna go default because I think these are all supposed to be little bonus. Oh, <laughs> look at us. Ah, uh, Babby's first day at university. <laughs> or that. That could always happen. Outfit? Any fancy outfits? Ooh, ooh, that's, that's neat. I like that. We haven't got the coat. Where's the coat? I like the coat. The coat's nice. What if furry? Yeah. Uh, that looks... It gives me Dark Souls 1 vibes. Once worn by a famed general from an eastern land. Again, default. I've not played this game before. We will not do anything silly. There's equipment. We have bag. Things in bag. We have the Azure Dragon Crescent Glaive. Which again, I want you. Is it seen? Oh, gestures. What? Sit! Check ground. Sit. Move to equipment. Uh, uh. What? What? No. I don't know how things work. I haven't got off the train yet. <laughs> Use. We can do a sit. <laughs> we're, we're, we're there. We, we're, we're down there. We're here. It's fine. Fashion souls. It is fashion souls because it doesn't affect equipment. You just do what you want. There's a lot of blood I've just noticed. <laughs> That's probably not ideal. Um, what else did we have in here? I don't think it was anything, was there? There was check ground. Hmm, this is there's a lot of blood down here. Well, I've checked that. Character info, stats, vitality, vigor, capacity, motiv motivity? I remember performing in the motivity at school. Um, technique and advance, their words. Legion. Okay, is that like magic? Fable slots? Looks like it opens from the other side. Uh, we open from the other side, probably. We've got a hatch on the back, that's how you rewire us. 69 guard read gain, nice. Um, physical fire, electric blitz, and acid. The best things. Disruption, shock, break, we'll work all that out as we go, it's fine. Okay, I think I'm somewhat familiar with something now. Uh, Let's get you out of there. Find something that might help. A stick. A pointed stick. Hello. Big old barrel. More blood. Lovely. Um. Investigate. The streets are not safe. Arm yourself with one of the weapons over there. Much jam. It'll be helpful on your way to the hotel. Uh, oh. Path of the Cricket, Balance. Path of the Bastard, Dexterity. Path of the Sweeper, Strength. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> What's that? Is that a harp? Oh, there's like a hilt. The, the handle and the blade are separate? That's interesting. Um, do Big Bonk or Balance? I'm gonna go balance. Balance seems fine. Why not? Cricket. It's got the cricket. Okay. Who are you? Is that is that Jiminy? No, oh, we can move. We can move now. Ha! Now we're speedy. We slides. Thank you, robot. Okay, I have a sword. Uh, 
two bits of a sword, I suppose. What's this? Um, puppet saber blade and puppet saber handle. Cool. Interesting. Saber blade made by refashioning a soldier puppet's weapon. Slightly bent blade has remarkable st stability. They say puppets do not shed tears because they do not have souls for vessels. If they had souls, they would have something to put tears and lies in. Yeah, they're definitely emulating the completely impenetrable writing style. Um, red stain has faded to the point where the grease can't be distinguished from blood. The endless fighting was gone, leaving behind nothing but red upon this world. This story, I don't know. Is that Germany? It's, I think it's Germany, Germany. Germany, Germany, Germany. Yeah, bastard. Germany is a cricket in Pinocchio, so if you hear crickets, then yeah, it's Germany. That, was, that, was that crickets, was it? Anyway, we leave! That was a bit loud. Well, things are fine. Don't worry about it. Uh, lock on. Kratz Central Station. Well, we need to go to Hotel Kratz. That's a good sign. Hello! Am you Robert? You look like Robert. Slash, slash, slash. And Gemini also the dual star sign, like Jacob. Duality and stuff. Hmm. Very loud, wet noises. <laughs> Hang on. That's, uh... Fire in the road. Turn that down a smidge. We're all mucky. Are we all mucky? We're not all mucky. We're fine. Good. Sorry. I'm only kick it once. Ooh. This one. Uh, I think as well. Left trigger used legion arm. What does that mean? That's block. Oh. Well, oh, now we're all mucky. We're covered in oil! Oh. Geppetto's gonna be real mad. Okie dokie. Oh, hello. Sawtoothed wheel. Right. Excellent. What? Th thrown objects. Cockwheel is a common sight in crack. It can be thrown to draw an enemy's attention. Even worthless items can become useful if you collect them. Everything will become useful in battle in the paralyzed city. Paralyzed city. Interesting. It's giving me, I mean... In terms of, like, gameplay... Bloodborne, absolutely, but also quite hefty Bioshock vibes at the moment, <laughs> which I'm not complaining about. Hitman coin. Throw of the coin, distract the laughing person. What's this? That looks important, doesn't it? Who are you? Grand exhibition, something, something nine in Krat. Maximum number of pulse cells has increased. Yes, Estus. Use a pulse cell to recover HP. There's a maximum number of times pulse cells can be used. When you reach the maximum, the cell will be discharged. If you attack enemies while the cell is discharged, pulse cell will be gradually charged. Fantastiche. Hello? Hello? Oh, oh, hello. Well, that looks like a thing, doesn't it? Hmm. Methinks we're coming back here. I'm doing a little slam. EP. Bin. Check bin. Jeeb, I have failed you. And, oh, that uses my... What was it called? Ah! Stop it. Legion. Legion? No, not Legion. Fable? I don't know. Uses the blue thing. Press the button. That... I'm not sure that button's attached anymore. Okay, well. I'm going in there, then. 
Just playing the game, trying to fit the circle in the square hole. This is a blue soap. We got three heels, that's pretty good. Over here. That's a window. It's over here. The fastest train in the world. We didn't bother to give it a name. Dim Ergo Fragment. Is that like souls? Uh, use upon items. No. No, it said there was a thing there, but it, it lied. Ergo. <clears throat> Obtain 100 Ergo. Fragment of Ergo, a mysterious power stone that can be found in Krat. Geppetto's puppet can absorb Ergo and turn it into power. Ergo is both a power source and a currency in Krat. Even small pieces can be put to good use in this city. A lot of things can be put to good use in this city, it turns out. Okay, so we've got souls. That's good. Or Ergo. Hmm. Oh, we've got to try the big door, haven't we? And Labra. Is that going to fall on my head? The station employee has the train station keys. It's locked. Got it. There, oh, guard. You can block enemy attacks by guarding. If your guard is successful, your character will take reduced damage. There are severed body parts strewn all over the office. That is actually appropriate in this particular situation. <laughs> Uh, reduced damage will be transferred to Guard Regain. Guard Regain accumulates but gradually decreases over time. While you have Guard Regain, you can attack enemies to recover HP. Oh, interesting. So it's like Bloodborne thing, but instead of getting hit, you just block then attack. That's neat. If a Guard Regain su uh, succeeds right before being hit, it triggers a perfect guard. Sekiro Deflection. When a perfect guard is successful, you will not receive damage, only stamina is consumed. You can use perfect guards to destroy an enemy's weapon or put an enemy in a staggerable status. Oh, it's Sekiro as well. Oh no, <laughs> I've got to be actually good at this game. <laughs> You've got Ergo. Ergo. Right, let's try. Oh, jeez. <laughs> what? 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 Ah! Ah, you were already on. Ow. Okay, let's try this. Didn't work. Hang on. Okay. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> I'm landing. I'm landing. Oh yeah, hang on. Turn the thing back up. Uh, thank you. Fable Catalyst. Getting a lot of things. Fable Charge. Catalyst made to supplement puppet abilities rapidly charges Fable. The Catalyst made puppets more efficient by circulating ergo energy within their bodies. This groundbreaking adventure was based on one, of, uh, on one alchemist's idea. What does any of that mean? I don't know. We'll leave it for now. Oh, hang on, actually no. I will try it for now because I think... To use it. Yes, it's the blue thing. It's the thing that I can do my cool charge with. Uh, what's down here? We're group landing. But yes, I'm gonna make many, many references to Souls games, for which I uh, apologize? Question mark. It sounds like we're heading towards thump thumper. Oh God. <laughs> more, more Bioshock vibes. Things jump scaring me in toilets. Thermite? You thermite? Um, a thermite bomb that can be thrown inflicts fire damage in the area of impact. After the puppet frenzy, people began to fashion weapons of resistance in their desperation. Many throwable weapons were manufactured and these exhibited excellent results against their marching enemies. So the puppets went all wibbly wibbly. To, to all? Oh, <laughs> I was just trying to read this on the wall. It says, to all parts of the world, but I read it as to all farts of the world, as if it was like addressed to people. To all farts of the world, listen up. Um, what was this? M m most? 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 Furry July. Okay. Um, don't think that's what it says. But... Can I go in any of these? Anything in the toilet? Okay. 
puppet frenzy. Everything's fine here, don't worry about it. <laughs> Oh yeah, my extra bag. I forgot about my extra bag. Speaking of bags. Take that! Environmental objects. Oh yeah, that's normal. Hey, Kiro. <laughs> about those Bioshock vibes. <laughs> Some luggage. A backstab's a thing. Let's see if backstabs are a thing. Ah, rear fatal attack. Right bumper. I can never remember what what's bumper? <laughs> I think it's I think it's R1. I think that's what that is. Nice. Well that went well. How are you doing down there, you're right? Trying to deflect. Yeah, get a little bit of health. Oh no, I think okay, I think you only get health. I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying to work things out, but I might not be reading things properly. Making mints! I dare this make you think of Comstock House. <laughs> it's got a it's got a bit of that vibe. Where are the the silence boys? Whatever noise boys. Passengers note, if anyone finds this note, get out of the station and run! De details. Give details. I pressed the wrong button. Um. Notes, if anyone finds this note. It yes. If anyone finds this note, get out of the station and run. Be sure to stay clear of the waiting room. I saw a huge puppet smashing people to death in there. Wow, thank you for telling us we did not notice. Um. What's this? Say? Dream of becoming a real girl. Harold Theatre, Rosa Isabel Street. Grand exhibition, something, something. They've they've crossed out that year, haven't they? <laughs> Pretty thoroughly. <laughs> yeah, we figured. We figured. Oh. Okay, so standard Soulsborne jump. Okay. Pre L pre Sekiro jump. Need a little jump. Excuse me, set. There you go. Oh, hi. Reflections are hard. Oh god. Uh, pulse cell discharged. Attack enemies to recharge. Yes, I'm aware. Ergo is life. Chamber of Machina workshop. Out viam and viniam out faciam. Excellent. I know what that means. It means break all the boxes. Oh, you can't break these. Boo. Another dim ergo fragment. Kratz Central Station. Where are we going? Uh, Keystone Express. Star Regional. Blah, blah, blah. St. Marianne. Dacia. All cancelled. Blue Fairy. Final Street. Hmm. <laughs> that sounds normal. Get the most loyal servant. Mm hmm. Is uh, Twitch being rude? Uh, not on my end. Might be just Twitch in general. Over here. Nothing, nothing over here. That doesn't match up. Come on, architects. You can do better than that. I have no heals. Let's go. <laughs> However, can I open this from the other side? Lock device. There are doors and ladders all throughout crap that are locked by devices. You can unlock these doors or go down the ladders to create shortcuts. Locked from the other side, you say? Yes, this button is intact. Hooray! Also got a fable catalyst. Great. Marvellous. Well, now we're in here, though. Um, I assume you have the key. Uh... Hello? Hi. Are you a, are you a local Bobby? Okay, not too tough.
Okay, that's not, that's not so bad, that's not so bad. Whoa, combos. Ooh, charge. I got a heal back. Thank you, Hollow Knight. Excellent timing. Fable Arts! <laughs> Why? Use blade fable arts while guarding. Use handle fable arts. Okay. Weapons have distinct blades and handles that each have their own fable art. Fable arts use up fable slots, and different fable arts use a different number of slots. Charge fable slots by attacking enemies with weapons. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna get hit. <laughs> Make a tutorial. <laughs> Never dodge away. Always dodging. That was neat. <laughs> Staggerable. Nice. Hold for a charge attack while you're attacking a white outline will appear around an enemy's health bar. When this happens, you can make an enemy staggered with a charge attack or with Fable Arts. Okay. That was neat though, wasn't it? Oh, okay, that's got a round hitbox. Boom! Krat Station Central Krat Central Station main entrance key and something else. Um, what was this? There was a thing here. Have oh, we got one of those? Uh, yeah. Slightly better defense. We did the thing! Movements, very pleasing to watch. It seems nice, it feels good. Blue shiny wearer is bashing the jam puddle. Get the shiny jam! What's this? This item was made in the puppet workshop for the purpose of improving strength while limiting the weight increase as much as possible. However, its weight is significantly greater than the standard version. Okay, I see, I see. Um, what happens if... Just, just destroy it. Uh, we got a key. Key once held by Krat Central Station Puppet. It opens the front entrance to the station. The station puppet fulfilled the duty imprinted on it. Its last duty ended with bloody violence. Bloody violence. Honestly. Uh, right. So we can we can do that, but our weight will go up to 46%, which I don't think is going to do anything major. It sounds like 50% would we'll probably do something major. That's fine. That's a lot of stuff in that thing. We'll deal with that when we get to it. Hello. <gasps> Ragdoll physics. Oh no. Hero's face when the mannequins come. Um. Right, jam. Ah, sawtooth wheel. Okay. Lovely. Well, can I get some heals back? That'd be that'd be marvelous. <laughs> I have two thousand ergo. The camera does not move as much when you t <laughs> turn, which is a bit unusual, but I'll get used to it. I used the Kratz Central Station main station key. Station. To the city! Let's see how the frame rate does. Ooh, pretty. I think it tells you a lot about me that I look at this and go, pretty. <laughs> this decrepit, rainy <laughs> city, but hey. This is pretty. Kratz Central Station Plaza. Rainy night. Rainy night? Is there like a time of days thing in this game? I don't know anything about this game. Oh, horse. Oh no. To be fair, there might also be a puppet. Many horse. Blue. Repair the Stargazer. Bonfire. Stargazer activated. Lovely font. Stargazer. Use Stargazers for fullery, reco fullery recovering. Fullery recovering. I repaired a Stargazer. HP and stamina, as well as charging your pulse cells. You will be revived at this point in case of death. Remember, this process also revives enemies, not just your character. That's a nice looking bonfire. Bit weird, but sure. This is called a Stargazer. Thank you. A marvelous device the stalkers used in the past. Stalkers? Puppet door to exceeds danger estimates. Please reduce positive numbers or reset danger parameters. As
Yes, we are. Oh, he's crickets. We are not strong enough to beat the puppets. But if I lend my power to this stargazer for a moment... They level me up. Gather ergo, clever one. This stargazer will make you stronger. Ergo. But the stargazer's strength doesn't last forever. So be careful with it. Huh? Hurry up and come to Hotel Krat. Temporary le temporary leveling up? Choices. <laughs> um. Okay. That's health and guard regain. That's nice. This is vigor. That's stamina. Capacity is legion of weight. Still not entirely certain what legion is. Um, motivity and technique. Okay, so this is strength and dexterity. Um, advance, arcane, I suppose. Magic, the magmic. Okay, well, um, survival would be nice. So I'm just gonna get some more health for now. Sounds grand. Swoosh. Anything in storage? Or I can just shove stuff in there. Okay. Uh, well, I don't have. Well, I don't know. <laughs> I never use storage in these games anyway. Oh no! Well, I can I can put in that weapon that we got as a bonus. Get rid of that, so I don't have to be tempted by it. Don't tempt me, Pinocchio. Uh, hello. Who are you? Notice, eh? Oh god! Stop it! None of that. Give me your sawtooth wheel. What was this? Welcome to the city of Krat in honor of Valentius. Oh, Valentinus! Can I investigate it again? Who erected to the cornerstone of origin? There's a lot of MacGuffin names happening around here. According to the internet, the Legion Armour's prosthetic arm that provides Pinocchio with. Okay, so that's the arm. Got it. Cool, cool, cool. Nice. Oh, dog. Mechanical dog! Don't make the mechanical dog make sad dog noises. Okay, Fable Catalysts are going to be a common drop. Got it. So don't worry too much about using those. Can I break this? I can, but I thought there'd be something in it. Uh, I'm, I'm being given choices here. I don't like being given choices this early. <laughs> like all the souls in the board and Kira games are full of MacGuffin name nonsense. I know, but now I have to learn a whole new lot of them. <laughs> I already know so many. <laughs> and they're all basically meaningless. Hello? Handle Fable Arts. Okay, let's, let's try some stuff. Oh! What was that? Better attack? Should probably look in the item description to learn what that does. They are covered in much oil. Fable Catalyst. Krat Times, issue 183. The Krat Grand Exhibition has been delayed. The decision was made to protect the citizens until the puppet frenzy that has recently paralyzed the city is under control. Yeah, I think that's more important than the Grand Exhibition, so good job. The occurrence began on Rosa Isabel Street, resulting in hundreds of casualties. While the cause is still unknown, the number of casualties and the scale of damage are both growing. As the crisis dragged on, the workshop and Vinigny Company... I definitely pronounced that correctly. Kratz's largest puppet factory announced that they would offer emergency supplies to citizens and do everything they could to alleviate the situation. A task force is investigating the possibility of a fatal loss of the Grand Covenant, what? which is the control protocol of the workshop's puppets. Got it. Okay, thank you. Thank you for explaining. <laughs> However, there's no quick solution as of now with the puppet frenzy resulting in more casualties. Venigny. Venigny, so I'm definitely saying it wrong. Thank you, Hazel. As the city braces for a resurgence of the petrification disease, <laughs> the citizens were advised to stay indoors for their safety. However, many citizens are trying to escape through Krat Central Station, intensifying the general chaos. The petrification disease. Alongside the Grand Concord, or whatever it was called, and the 
And many names. <laughs> many capitalizations. Hi, how you doing? Some blue there. So there's a way down here. Which seems promising. Nothing here? Nothing here. There's also a way over here. Ah, but there might be a locked gate, so let's investigate that first. Stamina seems pretty generous, and that's good. That's nice. The illness! <laughs> I can't open it. The handle's been taken off. I won't be able to open it. Man. Can't backstab you when you're on the floor. Also, very generous stagger. Sawtooth wheel. That looks pretty, pretty locked, doesn't it? Okie dokie. What does it say? Most loyal servant. Cool, cool. Oh? <laughs> Trap door. Four season books. Four seasons coffee house. <gasps> A book and coffee shop. Yes, please. Right. Up here. Lovely, lovely. Another locked door. Another does not open from this side. Yep, that doesn't open from this side. That's a nice way of doing does not open from this side, like the button on this side has literally been smashed in. <laughs> That's kind of neat. Yeah, hide out in a book and coffee shop. So Stuck. Great. Stuck. Oh, the circus, everybody. There's a circus. Oh, joy. <laughs> ashes to ashes. 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 To ashes, to ashes, to ashes. Sorry, what was that? <laughs> I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck! <laughs> I wanted to see if I could do a jumpy attack. Can I do a jumpy attack? No. Some more ergo. The clown? Is there a clown? Oh, everyone must go to the Efteling. The clown says so. <laughs> We're going to the Efteling, everyone. Yay! <laughs> yeah, doggos. I do not remember clown doggos in the Efteling. Oh, hang on. Is that a... Ah, there's a little, like, dodge back, attack forward situation going on. All those combos that I never do. <laughs> okay, all seems fine. All seems good, all seems grand. I want to go up there. <laughs> I'm getting a Dishonored vibe as well, and I just I want to I blink. <laughs> oh, now I'm getting a Bloodborne vibe. Look at this! <laughs> Telephone? Hello? Attention, dear citizens of Croft. The recent public frenzy is believed to be just a momentary glitch. Really? There is no cause for alarm. None. Do not panic, whatever you may hear. <laughs> the city is safe to traverse. We repeat, do not be alarmed, citizens of Croft. We are effectively handling the situation with the cooperation of the workshop and the alchemists. The puppets are, naturally, imprinted with the Grand Covenant that prioritizes human safety above all. Mm -hmm. Please remain patient while the proper situation. Your active cooperation is requested and required. You will refrain from any unauthorized departures, assemblies, or active protests. 
Never forget that your safety is of the utmost importance to your safety. The time for fear is <laughs> over. Crad is safe. That was very Bioshock. Crad is And then a bunch of noise. Well, everything's fine. Everything's fine. Define safe. Um, much like things in a safe, uh, trapped and unable to go anywhere. Um, no, it's uh, insane, especially with the distortion, but that voice sounds familiar to you. <laughs> Look, if anyone's going to work it out, it's you. I want to go up there. All right, we're by the sea. That's nice. Bottomless sea. Bottomless curve. I'm loving the combination of Bioshock, Dishonored, and Bloodborne vibes I'm getting from this. This is like perfect soup. The perfect soup, I tell you. It was unsatisfying. Fury attack! Some enemies will become red and use strong attack with a fury attack. You can't dodge or guard fury attacks, but you can counter with a perfect guard. Oh no! You're gonna make me counter! Okay. Bloody hell. Oh no. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> that was that. That was one. That was not one. That was a regular guard. That was not a guard. That was a good one. Could've gone better. <whistles> this one is also a place where everything's fine, yeah. You will learn to counter Crispy. That is a threat. Hmm. We're in a less affluent part of the city already. Nice change of scenery. What's over here first? Smash all the things. What is this creepy bloodborne nonsense? <laughs> Burning Witch of Hemwick's up there. <laughs> what hasn't been found in the Dishonored RPG? It's fine. <laughs> I was not expecting it to go like proper bloodborne straight away. I thought we'd have a bit more time in Paris, but no. <laughs> Lovely. This is a very pretty game, apart from the sausage tree here. Um, I just want to climb. I want to climb things. <laughs> Hello, how are you doing? You're right. I will be your killer this evening. Oh, don't shoot me. Ah, don't hit me. I see your tactics. You don't have a head. So I bet you didn't see that coming. Um, hi, Oobs. We're Timothy Chalamet. How you doing? You're a good old Tim Tam. His clothes are very oily, but his face is pristine. Thermite. He, has, he also has thermite in his pocket, and that is not a euphemism. Um, grand exhibition. Still not going great. Well, not going. It was cancelled. We are in uh, the the what seems to be the tail end of the Great Robot Uprising, so you know. Oh, we can down attack! Brilliant. Hello there, the angel from my nightmare. The shadow in the background of the moon. Okay, so it's not Bloodborne Rally. Well, it is kind of Bloodborne Rally, but only if you guard. You don't get any more health, you can only regain the health. That's gonna be Walk up. <clears throat> I know how ducks are oily, so water doesn't stick to their feathers. No, oh, yeah. There's a deliberate thing. Vinigny's urgent repair tool. Interesting. 
cannot open. Um, what is what is Vinigny's urgent repair tool? Instantly repairs weapon durability. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Um, I, I think I've been locked in just above the ground floor. Well, I can't I can't climb, so sorry. Always wet, just so oil slides right off. <clears throat> Wait, so you're covered in water to stop oil is the other way around. Um, an emergency repair tool made by Venigni immediately restores weapon durability. An emergency repair tool that Venigni made to support stalkers. Regrettably, its manufacturing facility was destroyed during the puppet's occupation, so it has become a rare item. Um, this repairs weapon durability, but this instantly does. So does this take time? What is my weapon durability? Let's have a look. Um... Oh, uh, under half. So uh, there's already something to bear in mind. Oh, I see. There's a bar over there. Is it in my elbow? <laughs> my elbow is a grinder. <laughs> well, all right, then. <laughs> right, that is vagina urgent repair tool. I think that's a different thing. Pinocchio Chalamet is trans. I mean, we are constantly swapping in bits of new equipment, so I imagine it's, you know, rather easier to customise one's appearance if you're a robot. Puppet, it can have whatever journals as they want. It need not conform to any existing ideals of human appearance or gender. It do what it likes. They dropped a blue shiny? Oh, they, they drop Ergo, which shines blue. Ah. And this is where we were before. Get me through! Uh, yes, so this is the circus. Yes. Things are going great. The a powerful parade puppet is blocking the entrance, and that's the only way in. So please, be careful. The powerful parade puppet, huh? Well then, um... Well, I've just opened up a shortcut, so... Let's see what happens when I die. Give uh, myself a little thingy. Okay. <laughs> No? Oh, you're an NPC? Is this like a test dummy? Hello? Hello? Hello there! Hi! Welcome to Krat, visitor. I didn't think there were any stalkers left to fight the puppets. Ah, hunters. You didn't stalkers hear? are hunters. Figures. The whole organization fell apart. All that's left are wannabes and amateurs who think they can fight on their own. You ought to buy something while you're at the festival. You can't rely on yourself alone. The hunter must hunt, and a stalker must stalk. Out here alone? You could use some help. Here's a festival gift for you. Now get yourself something useful. What we got? Throwing cell. Electric bomb. Electric blitz abrasive. Okay, thunder to weapon. Puppet saber blade. Puppet saber handle. That's what I have. Wintry, wintry rapier's blade and wintry rapier's handle. Interruption. Great sword of fate. Oh, so this is more dex. This is more strength. I'm guessing these are the these were the starting weapons. So I'm pretty sure this is what we have, and that's CC. Okay. So you can just you can change your spec if you fancy. Oh yes, because it says a mountain bag one. Um, right, well, lovely. But, um, no thank you. I appreciate it. Um, are we going to see all these fun friends? I bet we are. <laughs> yep. No thank you. What's this? Oh, there's a thing. Get out hunting beasts makes you a hunter, but how does fighting puppets make you a stalker? <laughs> 
You like them? You like the... The clowns? Uh, what was this? This was stamina. Which actually does seem like a decent increase in stamina, to be fair. Um, I want to equally level motivity and technique. Let's just do that. A little bit more damage. Clown standees. They're fun designs. Oh wow, that one is just straight up wearing pants. Um, do you hit me? Kind of. <laughs> yeah, so this is like a training dummy. Oh, 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 I see. My timing is terrible. Uh -huh. Perfect deflects are hard. No! <laughs> it is much more precise than I would, would have expected. There we go. Yeah, that is very precise. Ooh! Ooh, cheap viewers! The one-two punch of the miss, the miss ban, and the the me report. Right, what am I doing? Where am I? Um. Well, there was, there's that, but there was also some stuff back here. So let's go check that. Fizz, fizzy rolly, what? Who? Standees. Standees. Oh, hello. Hmm. Wanted to see who they were. Ow. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> You're a trading dummy. Stop hitting me. We're in danger. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay, right. Oh yeah. I've not leveled up enough <clears throat> damage to hit them and kill them in two hits, but that's fine. Soon we will. Right, it's down here. What lies hither and yon? No. Stop. My thing. Fabla at least. Oh, it was just this. Okay. I can jump that, come on. Fine. Fine. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm not keeping up with chat as well as I would like to, because I usually have chat next to the game. Um, but I have the game full screen uh, for this, because uh, janky setup. Don't worry about it. Um, right, okay. That looks important, so let's go this way. Take a, another peek at Bloodborne. Oh, introducing the parade puppet! Here appears a terrific puppet that will enliven the parade! Introducing Parade Master, a remarkable puppet model from the workshop to celebrate the grand exhibition. Hello there, I'm the Parade Master. I like singing and marching with people. The Parade Master have the following functions. 16 jolly songs, cheerful laughter, and 54 parade phrases. Parade dances to delight children, the strength to carry six men on his shoulders, whether whole or in pieces. This Parade Master was made in big, com big in commemoration of the Grand Exhibition. Check out its charms on the eve of the upcoming exhibition. Forthcoming, thank you. Um, Bloodborne. 
Laugh, do you say? <laughs> I'm marching on. That was an also awesome thing. Uh, hello. Well, boss time. Whoa. Wow. <laughs> A little bit extra. First boss, let's go. Civ. Sorry, F fetal. Let's <laughs> say fetal. Hello. You look happy. Oh, well, that's. What did I say? We have been waiting. Yep. Buried master. Got it. Cool. I don't know the mechanics of the game yet. He's on fire. That's fine. Oh, okay. Well, that was unnecessary. What are you doing? Oh, that, okay. <laughs> Might have lost his head a bit. Oh, no, okay. Oh, did I do it? I did it! I did a perfect deflect, everyone! Clap in the chat. <laughs> Yes, disconnected. Great. And we're reconnected. Bloody OBS. <laughs> I was doing really well and OBS is disconnecting me. Rude. First boss murdered the stream, but I'm doing fine. <laughs> eh, too early. just got a heal back. Oh well. Right, is the stream back? The stream stopped exploding? I don't know why it died. That was weird. I think we're back. Who made this puppet? It was for the it was for the grand thing. We read a thing about it. Upon dying in the boss arena area, if you die in a boss battle, death ergo is created at the entrance to the boss area. Oh, that's nice. Oh, does it say at the top? 660? Is that what's left? He said butterfly. 660, nice. Rimothy Charlemagne. 
Lie or die? Lie or die? Is that what it said? <laughs> I was trying to check the stream on walking. I have no idea why that happened in the middle of a boss fight. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, oily, oily wall. <laughs> oily wall. <laughs> Beyond the oil wall. <laughs> Good thing our boy's wet. <laughs> Hi again. Come on in. We have been waiting. That's what it says. Lick it. Don't lick it. I use that heal, the sooner I can start charging the next one. Oh, okay, you can do that. Good to know, good to know. Oh, you, yeah, I know, I knew that. I, I, I literally just said I knew that. <laughs> The mechanic where you can line your nose gets longer? Maybe. The loading bar at the bottom is the nose getting longer. Now lying, not loading. Dog, get greedy. It's not greedy, it's just bad playing badly. Um, <laughs> I was doing really well. It's still rainy night, which I'm pleased with. I like a rainy night. It's good. Good times. Lost Ergo. 660s. So it's the same amount. We don't lose anything. Good. Going great. Finally, I guess there's something nasty. That's what he said. Dodges. Do the thing, and again. Yep, and yep. Oh, yep, spin after getting up, that's fine. Oh, there. That's a fun boss. 
boss. That's a good first boss. I like that. Oh, hello. Slash. Eliminated. El... 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 Parade things. Quartz. What? Things. What? Who? Let's go back. <laughs> first try. That bodes very well. That was actually a satisfying boss to learn. So... Good job, game. Uh, what? what? Want to level up, please? Okay, can't level up. All right. Can I only level up once per stargazer? Is that a thing? I don't know. Would you lie to me about the bosses? Hmm. Wimothy Charcuterie. I think that's right. Uh, oh, it's our friends again. Hello, how are you all doing? You doing well? Oh, new one. We got the old, the classic unicycle up the bum. Standard. Punch and duty. Patrol festival. Mm hmm. Oh, is this the, um, oh, this is the hotel. Ah, oh, Bloodborne's the hotel, I see. Lose it if you shove it. Nope. <laughs> Dim ergo fragment. Yeah, I don't know where they're disconnected from the internet because I'm attached to the Ethernet like I am the normal computer, so <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't happen again. Jump in fountain. No. Hello? Hi. Cannot enter. Interesting. This. Hotel Krat, the greatest luxury lux Stop leaving before I finish reading. <laughs> greatest luxury you will ever experience. Treat yourself to an unforgettable day. That is so quick. That disappears so quickly. <laughs> Wimothy Charcuterie, the next band to snatch Gumba Bund. We had that to quotes? <laughs> no, we can add that to quotes. Okay, fair enough. Well, I'm glad I got. Thing I should mention. The hotel security excludes puppets like you. Me? But why? So you'll have to lie to get inside. What? You're a special puppet after all. What? Do what? Hmm? There's one thing I know about the Pinocles. Is, is that lying is not good. Hmm. Hmm. I don't... I don't trust disembodied voices telling me what to do. <laughs> well. This is cool. I like this. Nice. Love a good overhang. That's going to take us to the next area, I guess. Well, we have a plaza. Love a nice plaza. Last time I was in a plaza like this, I was fighting a ghost. It's over here. Hello. How are we doing? Good. Mimothy Charizard, yes. Why was lie in scary red? <laughs> yeah. Kira knows what I'm talking about. Um. Okay, well, I don't seem fond of puppets. Which, I mean, fair, because, you know, the whole puppet, up puppet uprising thing. Hidden moonstone. Oh, we also got some stuff. The moonstone was not from this world. The Moonstone was not from this world. However, it was the most opt optimal enhancement material. In their urgency, technicians pushed forward with the using the Moonstone for weapon upgrade without time to review it any further. Okay, very portal. P-Organ ability activation part. 
colourful tiny ergo fragment. It activates a special ability when equipped to the P-Organ. There is a special kind of ergo with a different colour and vibration. The workshop uses uses this gem to bring out puppets' different abilities. Unkrishnang. Some more of this. What's this? Ooh, 5,000 ergo. Parade leader's ergo. I see. Ergo obtained from the parade master. It is packed with immense power. A treasure hunter may want this rare ergo. Although the entire audience disappeared in a pool of blood, the parade master was cheerful. As long as there's a king, the show must go on. Well, that's that's not very pleasant, is it? Uh, over here. Parade puppet. Good. Good stuff. Lovely. Got to know what they were saying? <laughs> right, let's see what we've got going on here then. Good. The I'm not yet. I'm Pinocchio. Pinocchio. I'm a, I'm a puppet. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a puppet. Puppets are a constant source of trouble. The hotel forbids all outside puppets. Please leave the premises. No. Bad times. Hmm. Do I have to lie? <laughs> I know it's called the lies of P, but I got suckered into this with Undertale. <laughs> Thinking it was the only option. Use my P organ to lie. Hmm. <laughs> Is there no like? Can I break into a window? There's not. These do not look like break-inable windows, do they? <laughs> the screen says lie or die. That yeah, that's fair. All right then. Welcome to the sanctuary of the Grand Covenant. First playthroughs with choices are always are about making you? mistakes, so let's go. Human. Grand Covenant's fourth law. <laughs> A puppet cannot lie. First lie. Welcome to Hotel Krat. Yes, because the Grand Covenant's going so well right now. My my springs are reacting. <laughs> what? what is this mystical nonsense? <laughs> Cake or death? Sir, everyone's choosing cake. Gonna run out of cake at this rate. This statement is false. <laughs> this. <laughs> Your Himothy salad main. <laughs> Lies of L R P. That's a fun introduction, I like that. Hello, Law? Oh, ah, oh, 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 we got a cinematic opening. This is neat. Ah, they found the Ergo. They stuck it in Automaton. And made some very good decisions. Everyone thought it was a great idea. A new Eve with something. Ah, oh, look at them. They're the big old heavy lifters. Everything's great. City of tomorrow. Today. And then things happened. Ooh, that's, that's interesting. <laughs> Where was that? Feels like I should have played before the what we just did. Ooh, Turfly.
And then the trypophobia struck. Oh no. The maximum number of times pulse cells can be used. Great, cool. Oh, that's a paper clip. Look at that. Hello! Hotel Krat. How you doing? Oh, is it you? It's Sarah, whatever your name is. Sandra? Celine? Sally? Serendipity. I'm so happy to see you. So happy to see you. That's a long name. I am Sophia. Sophia, that's the one. <laughs> I've been waiting for you. Searched all over the city of Krat to find you. I'm here. You must have questions. Many. Geppetto will have answers. But we have to find him first. He was last seen on Elysian Boulevard. Elysian? All of Krat is dangerous for humans. And that neighborhood is one of the scariest. Please find Geppetto on Elysian Boulevard. I'll explain more once you find him. Bloody enigmatic character. Level up! You can level up through Sophia using Ergo in your possession. You can increase your stats when you level up. I have been leveling. Thank you. Um, I haven't needed more stamina, so just a bunch of health would be great. Look at Jenny. I think he's in shock. That is next to my bum. Jenny is fine. That's proof you're broken. <laughs> the real Jenny isn't so calm. <laughs> I'm no inventor, but perhaps I can fix him. Or perhaps he'll fix himself in time. Similar to what Kira was saying about Murderbot. Wait, take this pocket watch. <gasps> pocket watch! I love pocket watches. Krat is a labyrinth of peril right now. There's nothing there. This watch will guide you to a safe place. Don't gaslight me. Be careful, clever one. Run, you clever boy. Moon phase pocket watch. A pocket watch imbued with mystical power. The power of the watch turns back time to when the boy was in peak condition. What? What? <laughs> You, you with you with what with the huh? Teleport to hotel or last stargazer used. Okay, cool. So that's instead of exploding, I guess. Do you like her coat? A lot of good coats. I was looking at the um, main character's coat, which we don't yet have. Um, is this coat? No, it's not this coat. Almost this coat, though. This coat has a kind of cape on it as well. Um, not a cape, a kind of hood. What's the bit of the hood that goes over the shoulders? Mantle? I can't remember. That. Looks like you could, <laughs> you could never afford it and it would look horrible on you. Oh no. <laughs> Basically all my fashion sense. Oh, this oh, oh. This is a stargazer race. You know. <gasps> Hub. You can transfer from one stargazer to another. You can only travel to those you have activated. Stargazers in areas with an event will be marked with a hint. An event, you say. Also, there are apparently three people here, so let's have have a little, little wander around. I'm gonna investigate the hub. It's a very pretty place. I feel like this needs to be looked at entirely in like sort of straight camera angles with Wes Anderson lighting. Light of wide shoulder and wide hips to become a rectangle. Oh. Well, that's not wide shoulder and wide hips. That's the same width as everything else. Hello, who are you? Welcome to Hotel Croft. Polandina. My name is Polandina. Hi. Butler to Lady Antonia. Who? Please let me know how I may be of service. Tell me who Lady Antonia is. At Hotel Croft, comfort and calm walk hand in hand. Welcome to Hotel Croft. How may I be of service? There's no puppets. Not a puppet, it's an automaton. I can buy stuff. Fable Catalyst, Legion Magazine. Polymer filling that activates a Legion arm's specific ability. It can be implanted into a Legion arm to charge Legion rapidly. The polymer bullets that are used in Legion arms were developed in collaboration with a Venigni Works. These bullets undergo a chemical reaction inside the Legion arm and turn into different substances like fire, electricity, or acid. Okay, don't know what that means. My quartz! P-organ activation. Lovely. 
don't have enough money. Oh, about the Grand Covenant. The Grand Covenant is a set of absolute commands imprinted on puppets when they are made. Mm -hmm. First law. All puppets <laughs> must obey their creator's commands. Are there going to be three of them, by any chance? Second law. A puppet may not harm humans. Third law. A puppet protects and serves humans and the city of Krat. Fourth law. Yeah. A puppet cannot lie. I've told you about the laws engraved upon every puppet. Do you require anything else? Have you read much science fiction? <clears throat> Never heard the name Asimov. I'll use my power to help you. Have a chat about Ergo. Ergo is the miracle that made Krat prosper. <laughs> like Adam. Without Ergo, there would be no automated puppets to make Krat healthy. When you move, fifty-seventh floor, a puppet ergo can do a funky little dance <laughs> if required. More ergo. It will make you stronger. No funky little dance. At Monad's lamp. In the folklore of Krat, folklore? a cricket often acts as a guide. That is why these automated models became popular. But Gemini is unique. He's more than just a guide. As you get He's more familiar idiot. with Gemini, you'll see what I mean. Cool. Thank you. This looks neat. Over here, I don't, I'm, I'm aware of the swords, I'm aware of the knives out thing there, but Eve Engineering or just V? As I was reading that as EVE. Seventy sixth law on Wednesdays, puppets wear pink. <laughs> oh, hello. <gasps> Craft machine, switch legion arm, left arm of steel. Okay, I can change my arm out. That's neat. On a lathe. Um. Pikachus? Pikachu. Hello there! You look cool. I like you already. How are you doing? I heard about you from Geppetto, but to see you in person. Wow. Oh, little Rebecca. You should take this. Geppetto left it with me. Eugenie. What is it? Is it the P organ? No, it's a. Stake driver? <laughs> Grappling hook? What is this? <laughs> 58th law, no I, I before E except after C, but only if it rhymes with B. 108th law, no double denim. Shame. Legion arm is a special equipment that is equipped on the left arm. Each legion arm has its own combat ability. Legion arms uh, can be modified into all sorts of forms. Modifications can be used, uh, can be made using the Venigni craft machine. Okay, so we just have a thing now. Hello. The sound of it alone. That craftsmanship comes only from the hands of Geppetto. You must be something else. A custom arm from Geppetto himself is quite an accessory. Oh, <laughs> I forgot him. to introduce myself. <laughs> I am Eugenie from the Workshop Union. Hello, Eugenie. I know my way around weapons of all kinds. I'm sure Master Geppetto would agree. If any of your weapons need work, bring them to me. Can do. I know my way around a weapon. Want me to look at something? Something, something, the organ. Um, upgrade. If you have Boonstone, Eugenie can help you upgrade the weapon's blade. The weapon's attack power will increase when you upgrade the blade. Some blades can only be upgraded with special Moonstone. There's a hidden Moonstone. It goes up by 11, which is not a huge amount, but I also don't know. I don't have another weapon, and I want to do more damage. So yes, please. Thank you. Need two of them to upgrade again. So, little warning. Usually when I play these games, I just stick with the weapon I had at the beginning. <laughs> Apologies if I'm not going to explore too many other things, particularly in a game where you have to upgrade things with limited supplies. I can alter the handle. Here we are. You can bring Eugenie cranks to alter weapon handles. Each handle's property upgrades based on your character's default abilities. You can change this property and grade one time with a handle alteration. However, you can always reset it with a balanced crank. What? Um. <laughs> handle altering material. Oh, I see. I, I can re. Uh, right. 
Okay, so I can up. Th this would make it more strength scaling. This would make it more dex scaling. This would make it magic scaling, and then I can reset it. Okay, so this is like coals, like infusions in Dark Souls. Let's have a chat. A stargazer is a survival device used by the stalkers. They're the hunters. It powers itself by accumulating and absorbing ergo spores in the air. Spores? The stalkers installed stargazers all across the city. Spores? Once they're recovered, we can put them to use. We go back to spores. Any questions? Spores. <laughs> ergo spores? This is not, that's not good. If you want to test your skills or try new techniques, head for the garden. The stalkers captured a puppet to use for training. Don't look at me like that. Everyone hates puppets. I know whose side you're on. I have just noticed a cat in the background. Hello? No, oh, it doesn't like us. No. Oh. Hello? He doesn't like us. What if again, though? <laughs> something, something you can crack my handle if you know what I mean. Something, something. <laughs> spring! Spring the cat! <gasps> my springs! I felt it in my springs! Cat. Also, many other little cats. I organize this place according to the rules, so don't touch anything, Eugenie. <laughs> The rules, eh? Swads. Nice. It's a long cat. Cats can be long. Ah, oh, this is the garden, I see. View the guide again, main menu settings go. Ah, yeah, it's one of these. That would have been a great. Bonk. What's this? What's this? Great fortune to all visitors, rest for all travellers, blessings to all friends. Right then. Thanks. Cheers. I appreciate it. 121st Lord, don't touch the cats. <laughs> Right, my fancy new arm? How do I how do I fancy new arm? Puppet string. Oh. Oh. Little ranged attack, eh? How ranged? That range. That's pretty ranged. Now we're in civilized society. Nothing here. Nothing under there. Okay. What's over here? A gramophone. Ready? It's actually a gramophone. Okay. <laughs> well, all right then. Looks like you were part of the Great Petrification, or whatever it was. Unexpected guests are welcome. We don't insist on reservations. I am Antonio. Hello! And this is my hotel. It's very nice. Welcome. Thank you. Oh, I knew from the moment we met the George Petto's puppet. But I lied! You might have a few loose screws, but Gepetto's skills are undiminished. It's a shame. He took off for Elysian Boulevard. And he never came back. If he doesn't turn up soon, we'll have to make a new coffin. <laughs> oh, I forgot. I was keeping this for him. It comes Gets out of the with chair. a long story. 
But I think it's better off with you. Please find that old man. And do take care of yourself out there. Got to find Dad. Someone's memory. Show off clothes. Hmm? Oh yeah, oobs, in case you missed it. <laughs> we we have some hats, including dog. Perfect. Someone's memory. The uniform of a sophisticated and dignified boarding school. These clothes have been worn before. The uniform of a boarding school famous in Kratz. The initial M is engraved on an elegant brooch. Hmm? That's kind of neat. A bit sailory. What do I prefer? This read that as someone's mummy. <laughs> someone's memory, eh? M. Uh, well, no. That's... I don't have to be stingy with costumes, do I? Um, but I can. Look at me new clothes. Marvelous. People have no idea so many secrets are buried in Krat. Thanks for keeping me company. What are you curious about? Uh, spores. About lying. I see you're here. That means you can lie. Mm. Your lies are a rare ability. You're able to choose your own path, unbound by anything. People on the outside are still afraid of puppets. Lie to protect yourself and find your path. <clears throat> Cute little sailor scout. Hmm. Sure the spores mean nothing. Hmm. Geppetto. I'm an old friend of Geppetto's. <gasps> His son is like family to me. What, me? Who? Make yourself at home. You're always welcome here at the hotel. If you have any questions, ask my butler, Polandina. I have met them. Is this you? Might be. It's your hotel. Makes sense. Book. The Nikni Kratz Landmark Guide 1. This month's attraction, Hotel Krat. Hotel Krat is one of the city's creepiest and most mysterious buildings, and yet nobody has any idea that there are secrets buried here. Hmm. What is it with people staring at paintings of themselves? This is, you know, Dorian Gray said a trend. According to lore, Hotel Krat, or history as they say, Hotel Krat is an isolated castle built by an aristocrat devoted to a form of occultism after receiving a revelation from a radiant tree. Okay. At one point, it was used as a mental institution, and some patients said they saw hallucinations. However, no records remain, as they were all destroyed in a large fire. Above all, being so far underground just compounds the rumours. Some even said that it is connected to an unknown hell. It's not underground, are we? We're pretty, pretty sure we're above ground. Tree, Elden Ring, it's everything. But now the rumours have served to embellish the charm of Hotel Krat, which has been renovated in the latest style. As the recent rumours of the grand exhibition Ghost Hotel spread... Hmm? Are we doing a one of those Bloodborne things where this isn't a real place, but we're going to go to the other real place at some point? More customers are actually looking to stay at the hotel. Next is a comment from the hotel owner, Ms. Antonia. A ghost hotel? I've... This is her voice, by the way. I've heard that more times than I can remember, but fortunately our hotel guests are brave like lions. It's not a problem at all. Rating, four out of five. Creepy and mystical. Best resort in Krat. Reporter, Medoro. This guide was made with the support of the Vin Vinigni Company. Friend of the city. I have to keep stopping myself saying Vigini or whatever. Um... You've been studied at the law. You Lorian. Hello, what did you miss? We're in the hotel. We're having a chat. We got we got a cute sailor outfit. 
we're a sailor, yeah. Can we play the piano? <gasps> we can. Interesting. <laughs> Making my way downtown. Making my way downtown. Not quite the inflection we need. Do you get better if I do it again? Those first four notes are actually the first four notes of a piece of music I wrote recently, so that's kind of weird. Um, same key as well. This is a pretty place. Right, upstairs. Presuming that's onwards? For now, upstairswards. Not allowed in the hotel. Oh, no, hang on. No. There should be a door there, come on. All the details on the ceiling. Ceiling? Other ceiling? Ceiling downstairs? Ooh. To the Cherub Hall. What's in here? I need Rosa Isabel Street entrance key. Okay. There's no door handle. There's no door handle. Uh, yeah. this, this. Jack, it doesn't matter how many times you say it, there is actually a door handle. I can't open it. The handle's been taken off. No, there's a. Jack, there is a door handle. I just don't have the key for it, alright? There's no door handle. There is a door handle. That's just locked. Oh, there, there isn't a door handle on that one. The handle is missing. To be fair on this one, there does not appear to be a handle, but... But on the other one, fairly certain there was a handle. Something, something really needs to fix this. There can only be one door handle. <laughs> okay then. Onwards and outwards? Uh -huh. I see. A guest is waiting for their door handle. <laughs> and purchase items. I I have we did what did we we got the thing, right? What this? Quartz. Pilgan ability activation part. How do we use this? Trap door. Need to equip it to the Pilgan, I don't know how. Maybe we need you better for that. The window's locked. I won't be able to open it. It's got a lot of random lights on. <laughs> Conspicuous. Right. I was really expecting him to smash it again. <laughs> Special weapons cannot be assembled with other weapons or be disassembled. Some weapons are meant to be used in their natural state to appear to appreciate their elegance and beauty. Ooh, a funicular railway. P organ. <laughs> Dad, you need to sign this form so the school can teach me how to equip things to my P organ. <laughs> All the other kids know they went on the school trip when I was sick. Swaggering around in the sailor uniform. Let's go! Where are we going? Oh yeah, Japan. Elysian Boulevard entrance. Cloudy morning. Oh. Yeah, shame. I like the wet night. And wow it. Okay. 
Okie dokie. Hey, let's be more careful. Ah, the Black Rabbit Brotherhood. I hate these guys. They are rabbits. But don't be alarmed. My name is Gemini. Hi. We'll talk later when we're safe. You've changed. Black Rabbit, no. No. Germany's sounding a lot better. Or a lot more American, anyway. Speciality de café. Café, restaurant, wine. The highest popularity. The world-winning café, restaurant, wine. World-winning? Hello! Do a little dancey, do a little jig, and then the eggy leggy. Bread, you say? Give me the bread. Well, you are the next v Venice. Horse. Le bistrot de crap. Mrs. Potts. Let me get a Mrs. Potts. That sounds nice. Like the teapot? Yeah, I guess so. Uh, Theodore Books. Aubrey St. Bakery. Sorry, Aubrey Street Bakery. Dale's Bookstore. One of Kratz's oldest bookstores. One of them. Away! This turn's finished! Yeah, I know you're there. Hello. Fiddle? Did it say fiddle? <laughs> you are the next Vinigni. There's Dale. Oh yeah, Thidor. <laughs> Thidor. Tips the door. Put organ. There was a blue thing. There was a blue thing. Throwing cell. Electric bomb. High volt is the door again. The best bookstore in crap, but it's over there as well, which is also the best bookstore in crap. It's also a hair and beauty salon. Clements. Theatre Clements. Synchronized die. Love to see it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh. <laughs> Love seeing a ladder you can kick down. Um, presumably. There's a sparkly thing up there, so I'm guessing so. New era with Venigni. Who's Venigni again? Keep hearing Venigni. Elysian Boulevard was a regular rich people row. You wanted fancy boutiques and shops. <laughs> no place better. Like the door. But that was long ago. Before the puppet frenzy. How long ago was the puppet frenzy? It hasn't been specified when it started relative to now. Hi. Uh. Four Seasons books. Vivid Ergo Frag. Come on, open it. Coffin chest? Gotta open a coffin chest. Are there coffin chests in Bloodborne? There should be. Oh yeah, there are. In the, um... Chalice Dungeons. You are tomorrow. What's in there? Don't know what that is. Oh yeah, Jeep literally just asked that in chat. How long ago was the puppet friends? <laughs> Every shop in this place is either a place to eat or a bookshop. France. Keep calling this France. I have no evidence this is France. 
Star fragment. I'll cross dimensions. What? Ran out of stamina. Oops. That was very poorly managed. Um. The Pinocchio is an Italian town, right? Yeah, but it looks like Paris. <laughs> Does to me anyway. Um, I have that to look forward to. I haven't done any chalice dungeons yet. Eee. Yes, I am aware. Even I am aware. With names like Geppetto. <laughs> the Pinocchio is an Italian story. Lada F150 frame. That sounds like I'm suddenly got invested in motorsports. Um, well, Lada F-150 frame. It's heavier, but it's better. Um, can absorb physical damage. Okay. Made to order items specific to Lada, the puppet parts workshop. It has been in use for a long time, so despite being heavy, it is reliable. That will put me over 50% movement. Does that, that, yeah, that feels slower. Oh, it's not slow. I'm just slow. Okay. So what is the problem with weight? Is it is it only 100% or is it 75%? I don't know. Okay. Oh yeah, we've got a harpoon gun. We got given it by cool weapon lady. Press the last stargazer. Stamina has never been an issue. Just go with health. Look. Goop. My arm runs out. All oh, right, it didn't run out in the place, but that's probably because it was a place, wasn't it? Um. Also, while I'm here, quick, do a quick elbow grind before I forget. Uh. Oh, oh that's already on. Gemini, thank you. Always check the quality of Ergo. Ah. <laughs> Classic. Legion magazine. My favourite. What issue number? Um, is there any way to get to there from there? Like we go along there? Get on top of that roof over there? Maybe. But there's a ladder to kick down, so let's do that first. People are shooting at me. Uh -huh. Gemini's emergency protection. Sorry, Gemini. Gemini's emergency protection. Yeah. Uh, temporarily protects death ergo when hit. Right. Food for the cricket puppet that receives help from Gemini. Food for the cricket puppet that receives help from Gemini. Okay. When used, uh, when there is a death ergo to reclaim, it reduces the ergo loss from being hit. Oh! Interesting. I didn't know that was a mechanic. The Gemini model was designed so that it could be fed ergo to build affinity. However, no one could have imagined that this model had another ability that it was even more special. Don't worry! I'll make sure to protect you. Interesting. We're a spiderman. Okay, so apparently if you... The the punishment system for this is that you you drop all your ergo when you die, which is fine. It's on the ground, but the more you get hit, the more you lose on your way back to it. Interesting. Interesting. Now it doesn't matter too much because I have played enough of these games to become completely desensitized to losing absolutely everything. <laughs> so. Sawtooth wheel. What's going on here then? Press the button! There's a button, press it. Yes. Okay, that would just get me on top of there. That's not 
that's neither interesting nor useful. Well, I got up, got up on the roof. That's what I wanted. Praise the P organ. Well, now my chat's not updating. <laughs> that's fun. Luckily, my bot's there. I can read that. But this is convenient, isn't it? Uh, Chamber of Machina Workshop. Inveniat viam aut faciat. Who knows Latin? Hello, you have a fancy hat. Ow. And a big old axe. That was supposed to be a block. Ow, ow. Well, <clears throat> good thing there's a ladder. Pub. What did that say? <laughs> I just got a real kill. That wasn't necessary of you. Yeah. But you have my thanks. Th thank you. Who dark dark darks honor evil. Thank you. Unfortunately, because my chat was disconnected, I don't know if you left a message. <laughs> thank you. How you doing? You having a good time? I'm having a good time. I died. Dark Sun Rebel. Dark Sun Rebel. Got it. Thank you, Hazel. Always useful. That's a hefty ladder sound. Nope. 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 Yep. Oh, yeah. Star Fragments. We didn't read them. Um... Rebel. She knows Rebel. <laughs> You're good. Good. Uh, meteor fragment that can be found in different parts of Krat can be used uh, at the cracks calling in front of a boss area to summon a spectre. Oh, summon. Dark Sun Rebel. It's, she can get it like that. It's, it's the lack of spaces that confuses her. Star fragments cross dimensions to grant human wishes. If you wish for it desperately enough, they may be able to summon someone who can help, who wants to help save this world. Give me back my border fly. Thank you. Dark Sun Rebel. Attribute resistance ampoule. Dim ergo fragment and some moon dust. What is what is the cracks calling where the black rabbit exists where we can use our P organ? These are all things in the game. <laughs> These are all things in the game. Attribute resistance ampoule temporarily increases attribute resistance. A special ampoule, a word I have only ever heard used in Silent Hill, made to enhance a puppet's attribute resistances. When used, it enhances a resistance to overheat electric shock, decay, and corruption. A robust defensive position is sometimes better than attacking. Defense is the best offense. The resistance sample was developed to raise puppets' tolerance to abnormal statuses. Grinder. We have, yes, we have our, um... Our elbow grinder. Which we use to repair our equipment. Yeah, it's a grinder. Uh... There it is. Grinder. Repairs weapon durability. To those in battle, the grinder is their lifeline. Thank you, game. Well, this is nice. And who's going to jump around the corner? No, no one. Anyway, welcome to uh, Liza Peak, where um, I robot happened. Asimov's laws um, got broken somehow. 
and all of the robots went and had a fun time killing everyone. There are stones we can put into the pea organ and they vibrate or something. Yeah, we can put quartz into the pea organ to make it vibrate. Um, we haven't found out how to do that yet. We might need to find Geppetto to do that. One boss down. Yes, we got the. It was a big clown. No, it wasn't. It was like a circus ringleader sort of thing. Um, whoopie dokey. Ow! <laughs> Not nice. Chimney sweep. Thank you. Rude. Uh, that was the wrong thing. Where am I being shot from? You. Slash, slash, slash. Okie dokie. Sharp pipe. Weapon? No weapon. Ooh. Bloody control schemes. <laughs> Playing different games with different control schemes. We've already looked at that. Um, sharp pipe. Throwing objects. Aha. Sharp pipe that can be thrown. It passes through the enemy and inflicts piercing damage. Some throwable weapons boast a great destructive power on their own. When combined with the strength of puppets, nothing more needs to be said. Ringmaster, yee. Geppetto's going to teach us how to make our P organ vibrate so we can go to the crack. Again, not incorrect. What is this? I don't know where that goes. But also, there's the thing. This is way too narrow. <laughs> Electric Blitz Abrasive, which I believe is like lightning paper. Whatever. Oh, paper. There's a ladder up, ladder down. Let's take the ladder down, I guess. <gasps> we can slide! Wow, one hand, one foot slide. That's stylish. <laughs> likes to show off. The boy likes to show off. Balance, yeah. Oh, and we can lie. The, the fourth the fourth of Asimov's laws is that robots can't lie, but we can. Sorry, puppets can't lie. Hidden Moonstone, weapon upgrade. Good, good, good. Does not open from this side. Oh, no, it does open from this side. Where's this, then? The doorway is sealed Look. by some mystical force. Oh, we're by, um, the, the, yeah. Where are we? <laughs> Theodore. 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 <laughs> it's not good. I want to use the shops as reference points, but there's a Theodore there. There's a Theodore there. <laughs> Where's this? Dog. Oh, yes, and then we went around there and there was a ladder. And then we went up, and then up there. I see. I see. Okay, good. Nice. Excelente. <laughs> it was totally legit, not a front for a job. Front for a job he's doing bookshop. Well, front for a job he's doing bookshop. Got it. Yes. Motivity or technique run? Uh, I went with quality. I went with cricket. So mix of the mix of both. Because I'm indecisive, and it was the first one that my thing was on. What's happened? Oh god! <laughs> Rude. Well, that didn't help. Okay, electric shock. Evidently, that's the thing. Try and avoid that. At all possible. Ruff, ruff. Ow, 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 Jimmy Sweet. Under the little, little under line. Jim, Jiminy Drew. Barking dog in a house. Is that a real dog? Stop it! <laughs> 
take care of these first. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Gosh, I'm not good at this. Um, Pulse Cell's just... Yes, I know it. Uh, well... Uh, hmm. Stop it! <laughs> Laddie grenade throwing butlers. Honestly. Can't be throwing batteries at people. I know! Can I get up there and kill them now? Gosh, you are learning a new game and will make mistakes. I'm learning a new game, but it's also a game that feels exactly like seven other games I've played. <laughs> I don't think he's going to stop it. <laughs> he verily did not want to stop it. Fight me, bitch. <laughs> right. Revenge. Take that. Oh, come on. Two hits, though. That's a hole in the ceiling. Vivid Goofle. Soul Tooth Wheel. Something over here as well. Secrets. Fable candle. See, this is what I wanted. I wanted I wanted wandering around rooftops and stuff. I wanna go in there. Ooh. Ooh, wheel. Ooh. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Haven't stopped to look around for a bit. Yeah, this now feels dishonored, yeah. It's a big old cable car going around. This is neat, I like this. Oh, hi there. Well, I'm sure I'll get to you eventually. Jim Jiminy! I missed. Frozen man's letter. By Louise and Charlotte, my treasure, I can't hear anything. I think the streets are already dead, nothing but silence. Oh god! <laughs> silence, you say? Rip me. <laughs> but do you mind? I dodged that. He said not dodging it. Um. Okay, this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the quite heavy stream. I'm very glad I set up some sort of bot thing. Again, I will have to fix it so the TTS appears on stream. But... Pickle. Random Elden Ring player. Is it that long ago we played Elden Ring, Lenio? That's how you deal with them. Also helps for avoiding the grenades. Right. 
What am I playing the DLC? What? This game have DLC? Elden Ring DLC. Oh, uh, not particularly bothered. Elden Ring was already a lot of Elden Ring. <laughs> Don't think I need to pay for more. Oh, Elden Ring DLC. Elden Ring DLC. Oh, Elden Ring DLC. Um, I am gonna go up on the roof and kill people just in case they start throwing grenades at me while I'm trying to take out the big boy. Yeah, it just came out, and it's been almost every everyone I follow on Twitter has been playing. Uh, uh, Twitch has been playing. This game had a few things, but you could not afford the fancy thing. What? No, miss, you came you bloody bought me a game. Shush. <laughs> it has already come with fancy things. Are you telling me this is not fancy? <laughs> Are you telling me this is not fancy? If that's not fancy, I don't know what it is. It's pronounced furry. Oh, I really, really wanted Hazel to pronounce that wrong. <laughs> Okie dokie. Hey there. Oh, hello, similar move set to the first boss. Yep, and then that slightly delayed attack there. Do the thing, do the thing, get in the place, there we go. <laughs> Can we talk about this puppet to Wonka? <laughs> Let us give all the puppets hats. Classic. Everyone's got to have a hat in this era. Uh, cool. But what's in the chest? What's in the box? Life amulet, our first amulet. Increases max HP. An amulet that can be equipped on a puppet. Information and memories that are useful for movement can be imprinted on the uh, symbol to draw out special powers. The slightest blink is enough to make a puppet move. Puppets do not have life, but it is enough to move them. Well, uh, it increases the max HP. Hmm. It's the... Show me, show me. I like 20, okay. <laughs> Got there in the end. <laughs> Puppets do, however, have fashion. Fashion. Back to the Zayla outfit. Um. Cool, bit of, bit of health. I like health. Health is good. I like bananas. Bananas are good. What's that? I don't, I don't wanna. Uh, ooh! Save point. <gasps> it's, it's friend! What you buying? Why, hello! <laughs> I didn't know anyone was alive out here. <laughs> You're the same person, Shush. I know what you're thinking, but I'm not a burglar. I'm just crashing in an abandoned house for a while. Don't worry, I won't cause any trouble. We survivors need to look out for each other. He was a sailor for your boy. Information, so such a year later, I boy. didn't steal this. 
Right, patches. Um, ooh, electric coil stick head, electric coil stick handle. CDB, ah, arcane weapon. Or whatever it's called in this game. Um, advance, advance weapon. Uh, emergency protection, iron protection. Protects Ergo even in death. When used, a death ergo will temporarily be maintained in case of death. Oh, okay. Interesting. Uh, some more electric stuff. Electric blitz canister. Pool of electric blitz where it lands. Mmm, splash damage. Some fun things I won't use. Nice to know, though. What's this? <laughs> I like what it says, press the button. Even though there is no button there, it is a sparking mass of wires. <laughs> but he still tries, bless him. Did I read the rest of that letter? Letter? Was there a letter? I can't go that way. Oh, yeah, no, I died, didn't I? Um, <laughs> excellent point. Um, my Louise and Charlotte, my treasure, I can't hear anything. I think the streets are already dead, nothing but silence. <laughs> I think that I, too, will become just another petrified corpse soon. Yes, there's a great petrification thing going on. Not sure what that's about. I still remember the sound of your singing voice and the sight of Charlotte looking at picture books. I miss all of it. The best thing I did when I was alive was send you and Charlotte to the cathedral for shelter. Unborn. The illness. Oh, remembrance. I wish this nightmare was all over. If only you and the kid would come back. But I guess now it's impossible. I love you, Louise. I pray that you're safe there. Now, is this uh, solemn contemplation, or is this something to do with the P organ? Well, you may never know. Do you feel like you should get in the true merchant spirit and do a merchant squad? Yeah. Switch legion arm. We only have the puppet string at the moment. It's fine. Oh, talk with Jiminy. I'm Jiminy, your friendly puppet guide. Hi! Or friendly guide puppet? I don't know, one of those. I'm also a friend of Sophia's. Last time I woke up, Sophia was there because... Because she woke me up. But I'm sure there are still other memories in there. Sorry. Must be the shock. Bear with me, and I'll do my best to guide you. Cool. Do you mind the fact that you're attached to my bum? This VA is also British. This VA is British doing an American accent in a game set somewhere in Europe. <laughs> Jiminy's really, I hate how you pronounce Sophia. It's fine, don't worry about it. Um, cool. We can't level with these anymore. I have to go back. Is that right? I don't know why he's doing an American accent, but he is British. Look, you want a game to sell? It needs to be full of American voices. <laughs> Even though all of From Software games have English voices for some reason. <laughs> Sekiro is an exception, obviously. Right. I'll use my power to help you. Thank you. Oh, we can show Miss the the weapon lady. It seemed nice. Uh. Okay, maybe we'll get a little bit of stamina. <laughs> but health, I think, seems to be rather important. Not dying. Handy. Um, good. I almost have enough Ergo, so let's use one of these little ones. Is that enough? I'll use that was very quick, I like that. A quick, responsive UI. It is not, I'm seven Ergo away. Typical. Look at that. Done. I'll use my power. All from some voices of voice by Hazel and Robert. We know this. <laughs> uh, yeah, a little bit of damage. They're both three up, so. Emphasizes the soft part of Sophia, but Sophia. Anyway, look, here is friend. 
I know my way around a weapon. Want me to look at something? Oh, hang on. You weren't here for this, were you, miss? Because if you weren't here for this, it means you were also not here for spring. Spring does not like us. We must find fish. Spring is valid, yes. Teleport. Uh, cool. Inside house on Elysian Boulevard. I would have preferred it, the ability to level up at start gazers, but um, use the phone to answer the King of Riddles correctly and get a Trinity key. You can use it to unlock a Trinity Sanctum hidden somewhere in Krat. Okay then. Cat is anti-puppet. Rude. They know we can lie. Inside the house on Elysian Boulevard. That is a, a very direct name. Not a very concise one, but a very direct one. More rooftops. We been here? Difficult to tell. Homo Machina. Hmm. Hello there. Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> bloody, 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 bloody. Stop with the things. Let me hit you. Well, that went poorly. Um. This house, we love our construct characters. Of course you'd use the phone to answer the Riddler to get the thing at me. I've played Arkham Asylum. Um... Wow, you track quite strongly. weapon parts have we found? None? I could have bought the, uh, the Tonitrus or whatever it was called. Oh, hello! Goodbye! But, no, we went before I could do anything. Can I get up there? No? Yeah. Uh, but it do... Venigni Krat's Landmark Guide 2. Venigni's Krat Landmark Guide 2. I know things. This monk's attraction, Alchemist Bridge. The Alchemist Bridge is the bridge on Elysian Boulevard and the main way to the Krat City Hall. The Holy Ouroboros, the mark of the alchemists, is fittingly engraved into the bridge. This shows that the alchemists are not just powerful, privileged class, but have also donated tremendous amounts of money across the city. Thanks to the thriving culture of philanthropy in Krat, you can find areas with names of prominent figures. It's like the city's motto, the citizens are the owners of the city. The most widely... This is very... That's very Bioshock. <laughs> like, hand on the great chain. Own the sweat of your brow. The most widely known attraction is Rosa Isabel Street. It is named after the cultural sponsor, Lady Isabel Monad. Monad. But if you think about how the ladies married to the leader of the alchemists, Valentinus, Valentinus, you'll think twice about who really is in control of Krat. The union of Krat's old families and the organization of alchemists is shown in this symbolic form. Given that the sacred Ouroboros mark is engraved on the city hall as well, it's obvious who owns the city of Krat. Rating 3 out of 5. A good place to learn about Krat's beginning, end, and its essence. Reporter Medoro. This guide was made with the support of the Vinigni Company. But may not reflect the company's opinion. <laughs> Eat the rich. Let him meow. Yeah. Is there a meow? Might be a meow. We are on rooftops. We've heard barks. Is that hotel? Speciality de cafe. Good 
creo que... way down here or is it just that ladder? Oh, there was something. Some sort of noise. Noise happened. Is there a way down here? No. Okay, cool. In game or he's just shouting now. I think it's in game. Oh hey King Bed. You sound like a cat. Mind, sir. Well, that's not great. Like we used to. Excuse me. Be with you in a second. I should have used my heal before I did that. Cough, cough. Hello? Who is it? Is that you, Murphy? No. Oh, I guess not. Sorry, I, I thought you were my friend, Murphy. Murphy is a super cool police officer. <coughs> As a puppet, even the petrification disease can't get him. I wish I was like him. <coughs> You should leave so you don't catch the disease from me. You, you're not aware of the whole robot going mad thing? If only we could play together like we used to. Murphy, I miss you. If only we could... Murphy. Can I dress as a police officer and trick him? <laughs> wow, Resident Evil. Hello. Oh god. <laughs> well, okay then. You're gonna be like that. A turning. <laughs> yeah. They have other concerns. Yeah, but. Anyway. What do we get? Workshop Union Standard Insulation Converter. Oh, my favorite. Always wanted one of those. Yeah. Appendage parts that increase the attribute resistances of puppets can enhance resistance to electric shock. That'd be pretty handy. An appendage newly developed by the Workshop Union and has new design enough to and uh, new design and enough versatility to be used in different places. Okay. Um physical electric damage reduction. Goes up to seven, which is nice. And a lot of blitz resistance. Uh, the weight goes up a little bit, but not a huge amount. They have the illness! All the items in this game definitely have very catchy names, yeah. I understand why, like, that the equipment is like that, because it's, you know, parts of a machine. <laughs> you are a machine, you're adding new parts. So, seems sensible. With these mines. Not the item descriptions that are Eldritch Law, but it's the item names. It's both. Oh. Wait. I can sense something strange. Jeepers. Jeepers. Is that a butterfly? Jeepers. Why is the ergo reacting like that? If you want to check it out, I can take yeah. point. Uh, okay. Hello? 
Okay. What are we what are we doing? Okay. <laughs> Jeep. Dimensional butterfly. Occasionally, a dimensional butterfly will appear in parts of Krat. Monad's lamp uh, can detect the butterfly, lighting up red to point out its location. When the character is near the hiding butterfly, it will appear. After a certain amount of time, the butterfly will disappear into another dimension. Kill it to get useful materials. You tell me that now! <laughs> After it's buggered off. I thought we were just following it. I thought it was like, hey, we found a thing. Bloody... <sighs> Gemini, you're useless. Is it Gemini or Monad? I don't know. Dogs. Let's see if I can do the whole thing. Yep. Just walk backwards. Train got a heal. Nice. Emergency protection. Well, I can make a wild stab in the dark. Hey, the Dark Souls, surely I know to kill the glowy thing. Yeah, but usually they're like scuttling along the floor, like running away. This one's just a Look, butterfly. I found your trap door up in the attic, but I can't open it. That's it's, it, it's up some stairs. Not quite an attic, though. You know, we got lucky with the severed body. Always blocked with metal bars. That that is technically true. <laughs> that is technically true that the doorway is blocked with metal bars by virtue of being made of metal bars. You're there, however. You're there. Some noises going on. Uh, let's have a quick grind. Yeah, you you follow me. Don't don't tell your friends where you're going. Good. They are indeed very glowy. There is a light pointing at them. Out of the shock! Out of the shock! I knew it was a trap in some description. In some with one some. Making you want to play Bloodborne even more, you also want to replay Bioshock Infinite and Dishonored as well. This it's it this seems like an amazing combination of Bloodborne, Bioshock, and Dishonored, and again, what a soup. What a soup. Mrs. Potts. Mrs. Potts is very prolific. Has many shops. Hidden Moonstone. Really need to finish Rebirth. Yee! Finish Rebirth. Right. I hope it's a grand old time. Enjoy walls, presumably. <laughs> Sekiro style parry, parry mechanic for funsies. Yes, and I'm much worse at it than I am at Sekiro. <laughs> okay, well. Where do I go now? Rather under the impression this would be the way forward, but I guess not. Because that's where we came out. Wasn't it? Sigh. Sigh. Where's the way? It won't open.
Okay, that's all blocked off. The timings are very it tight. Won't on budge. This here. I'll need to find another way in. The, the timings are very tight, but they're also like you know, they they have those attacks that are like the only thing you can do is parry these. If you do anything else, you take damage. <laughs> it's like great. Okay, so ground floor, nothing. Let's go back up. There was another ladder after that ladder. What ladder? The lock on the store is broken. Am I missing ladders? They're probably missing ladders. Ladder, ladder. That was the one up. The ladder over here. Go up and there was another one. Oh, I see. We'll go up this way. There's that one, which goes up onto the little roof thing. Anything over here? Oh, there's a big old hole in the wall. That probably means something. Um... Come on, fly everywhere. What does it say? Quarantine? Warning! Petrification disease quarantine zone. No trespassers. Everyone is a patient... Or a lunatic. Do not speak to them. Okay. Good old. Well, that was more dramatic than I thought. That was when you saw it. Never mind. Liza P. Always going. <laughs> always be going in holes. More window people. Hello. Oh. Ooh. This must be your first time in the petrification disease quarantine zone. For most people, this is their last stop. You are a good Samaritan for coming all the way here. I am one. May I ask you a favor? No. My family took my baby from me and sent me here. They said it was for my own good. But it was heartless, just the same. A baby must be with its mother. Please go to Quart City Hall and bring me my baby. I mean... I'll find her, he lied. <laughs> Thank you so much. Kind one. I can finally see my sweet Elena's face again. Through the window. Please hurry. Hard scales spreading across my eyes. Before I lose my sight. Please. She said the baby was at City Hall. Should we check it out? I hope everybody's safe. <laughs> that baby isn't going to be a baby anymore. I can't imagine we're going to have to carry a baby in this game, so... <laughs> Something's going to have happened to it. Uh, how's the full damage in this game? That's pretty good. By which I mean nothing. I mean, I, I mean something, but I mean... It was... Nothing. Very little. Uh, hello! I remember you.
Last time there was a big enemy, there was a save point right after it. Oh, oh god. <laughs> da blocking doesn't fully block things. Ah. <laughs> Fungus, baby! Okay. No shortcuts, but we know the way. Excuse me, what? Excellent. Rather hoping not, they're not following anymore. I'm gonna do them perfect parries on delayed attacks. Gotta love parrying delayed attacks. Starting delayed attacks. <laughs> destroyed his weapon apparently <laughs> I'm trying the guard <laughs> you played delayed attacks of the game aka Elden Ring and there's a reason I prefer <laughs> Dark Souls in combat um all right Krat police baton head Uh, head from the self-defense batons used by the Krat police, the hard cudgel can be used to bash all kinds of puppets. After the violent protests with the factory labor union, oh great, it became customary for police batons in Krat to be painted black. The reason needs no explanation. The handle from the self-defense batons used by the Krat police is the grooved lines make for a firm grip. It can be assembled with any blade. Do not ever rob a police officer's home. You won't go to prison. It's a one-way ticket to the sewers with a head smashed by a police baton. The advice of a retired petty thief. All right then. What's this? This is a strength weapon. Wow, exactly. We're in the times of union busting. Parrying's fine. I, I do need to play Elden Ring and parry, but... Oh. Broke your weapon. Because watching people fight Millennia and parrying her is very satisfying. Purification. Remove all status elements. And lock the door! I did it. I went to the other side of the door that I unlocked it. What? 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 Oh, hi. I thought it'd be something big. That was satisfying. Um, I'm gonna work under the assumption that this is locked. Venigny's Urgent Repair Tool. We have one of those, I think. No, no, that is openable. Hang on. No, no, that's the Great Bridge. Okay. That's the bridge what was being chatted about. That's what's in here. Read the book. 
Ooh, an elevatoire. <laughs> Repair. <laughs> Repair by punching it. Remember this? Nice. Shortcuts. Cool. I like that. That's good. Uh, I'm gonna go back to L'Hotel. Three left. Oh, cool. I'll use. I'll use. Of upgrade materials, nice. Not enough materials, what? I have four? What? Oh, I need, I need bloody. Okay, um. I'm good at this game, I know what I'm doing. I know my How much do I need? Now I need four to do it again. Um, so can you, yeah, alter handle? No, that's something else. Um, how do I, how do I break this apart? <laughs> no, don't destroy. Uh, now nah, whatever, we'll just stick with that. Okay, I'm, cool, cool. I know, I know what I'm doing. Of what I'm doing is ending. So yeah, everyone in chat knows what's going on, and I don't. <laughs> but yeah, that will be all for tonight. Swoosh. Music just stops. Um, and we'll be back tomorrow for more of this because this game. I'm gonna give you a little little uh, insight here, a little secret. Um, this game's good. This game's real good. Hope you're all enjoying it. Hope you're all having a lovely time. Apologies for some slight technical issues. I will try and resolve those for tomorrow. Thanks for stream. Thanks for game. <laughs> Myths. Bloody buying me games. Oh yeah, that was a thing I was going <laughs> to We were talking on the morning stream of like, you know, it'd be fun to... Uh, if anyone's bought me a game and I play it on stream, every stream that I play it, they get like a little 30 second ad <laughs> where they can get me to read something out. Can't wait till I get to the interesting bits. It's already interesting. How dare you? We already have the robot uprising. We have a petrification disease. We have uh, the alchemists and uh, the Ouroboros and spores. We have many things. A subterranean ghost hotel. <laughs> what more do you want? What more could you possibly want? Uh, but ye. The interesting bits. Well, it's fine. <clears throat> We've already lied once. I'm sure there are more lies to come. That seems to be a thing. Um, but yeah, I hope you uh, hope you're enjoying. Hope you're having a chill time. Or as chill as it can be when I'm just screaming because I get attacked by things. Uh, gonna get this deluxe, deluxe upgrade for you, but it's just some hats. It's fine. I, we can find hats. Hats are good. Time for Eep. Yes. Hope you all enjoy. I will leave with the soundtrack of another 
uh, Robert. Um, yeah, and I'll be back. Whoops, not yet. Shush. <laughs> I haven't finished yet. <laughs> Honestly. Honk shoe indeed. Have a lovely one, everyone. I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, oh, hang on. I haven't even clicked the thing, have I? I made this so that I could click it and it goes whoosh like that. I, ma I made that. I made that go whoosh. I invented it out of code. And I never bloody use it. But anyway, have a lovely one, everyone. Look after yourselves. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. Sleep well. Bye.